So you're planning your holiday party. When it comes to the alcohol, that part's easy, right? You just put some bottles on a table, put some mixtures on a table, you're good to go. Nope. I'm Rachel Davis, account representative for ABC's Concierge Services, and I'm here today to tell you five things you didn't know about planning your holiday party. All right, so there is a lot that goes into planning a party, and let's face it, we've all been out of the party planning game for a while now. So here's my insights on how you can throw a holiday party that people will be talking about for the rest of the year. Tip number one, I'm gonna recommend signature drinks for you. So signature drinks, I would recommend about two to three kind of festive holiday drinks. Um, this kind of gives a theme to your party. It helps you control how strong the drinks are. So you can kind of manage how much people are drinking. You can also have it in a batch ready to go so you don't have to worry about taking time out of the party from hosting to serve the drinks. It really creates a theme to the party. There is a few recipes I'm going to include in the links below. So a few of my favorite drink recipes that I would recommend for holiday parties, they're very festive, would be a Grinch Punch. So it is a bright green, very festive drink, very easy to make. Eggnog is also a classic for holiday parties. And then also, so it's a spin on a Moscow mule. It's called a Yule mule. And that would be another great recipe as well. Tip number two. So if you're not a fan of the signature drink idea and you just wanna stick with liquor, I'm gonna recommend the three usual suspects. That is gonna be vodka, rum, whiskey. Those are the top liquor categories. I will also recommend, whether it's a family friend you have as a bartender or you hire a mobile bartender, which by the way, ABC Concierge Service can help you find a mobile bartender as well that is licensed in your area. That will really add a nice ambiance to your event. People will be excited that you actually have a bartender serving the drinks and it will help with overconsumption as well makes it very easy, then you can just have some mixtures to go along with those three categories and simplify things. Tip number three, skip the sit down dinner. You're not gonna wanna do it. It's gonna take too much time out. You're gonna miss mingling with your guests. Go with some dense finger foods. That'll really kind of keep the party going and keep everybody's bellies full. Tip number four, so skip the variety packs on beers and seltzers. I know, crazy talk, right? But guarantee you that variety pack, there's gonna be one or two flavors that get left behind. So I would recommend instead going with two different popular flavors. That way you don't have stragglers left at the end of the night sitting around that nobody wants. And if you're not sure what the top sellers would be as far as flavors of seltzers or beer, ask us at ABC, that's what we're here for. We're happy to help. And if you're finding this information valuable, please be sure to like, subscribe, or ring that notification bell. And are you ready for my top tip? Tip number five, you don't have to do your party planning alone. ABC's concierge team is here to help you with that. Feel free to schedule a complimentary consultation with us. We have wine and spirits experts in our stores that are highly trained and knowledgeable in all the products that we carry. Please use their expertise. We'd be happy to help make you look good for your holiday party.